saved me. Hi guys, this is your girl, Leisha Joya. This is like take eight because I didn't realize that Windows likes to screw up sound recording devices on your computer when you do an update. So I had to go back in and fix that. So this is take eight. Many of you have asked me, how do I record my Second Life vlogs or my Second Life Machinimas inside Second Life without my HUD showing and without my name tag showing? So let me go ahead and get started on that. You will need Firestorm Viewer for this. I'm currently on Firestorm Release 64.5.0.1.5215. And at the top of my screen, on the left side, you'll see that um, release number as well as my name. Now you see on my screen, you see my name tags, it's unavailable. And then my name tag and my group I'm on and my legacy name. And then you see all my HUDs on my screen on my left and my right on my screen. Well, that's not something you desire. So let's go ahead and get that fixed. To get rid of the actual HUDs on the screen thing, you go to Avatar in Firestorm and then you scroll down where it says Show HUD Attachments. It's right above Exit Firestorm and it's second from the bottom. Click that and your HUDs are gone. They're not missing. Your AOs are working. All your HUDs are working per se, but um, they're just not visible on your screen. Now to get rid of your name tag above your name, you need to go to Quick Preferences, which is this um, button on your bottom screen, which looks like a phoenix, um, and you go ahead and toggle that off. And there you go, you got that off. You toggle it back on by clicking the name tag settings and these buttons that are on and off. On. And it's very easy to click it and to get all that set up. But say for example you don't have your preferences set up. Say for example you don't know where your quick preferences are. To get to the quick preferences you right click on your bar. You right click on any one of these buttons and it says toolbar buttons. Click on it and then you'll also get quick prefs and it's called quick it's this button right here right next to radar right underneath photo tools and then you can just drag it to your desired location and then it will I actually have mine always at the bottom right just easier right next to my inventory and then I turn it off just like that and voila this is kind of how I set stuff up when I do my Second Life recordings, my Second Life machinimas, and my Second Life vlogs. If you like this video, don't forget the thumbs up, don't forget to like it, don't forget to comment, don't forget to tell me if this helped you or not. If you have any more requests or anything like that, let me know and I'll be more than happy to get them started for you. Thank you guys for watching and I love you guys so much.